Let's find them. To request for the return, and not just a return, but of course, a swift return of its physical manifestation. Like I said, just right now, it has to be done out of a state of mind where it is free of klesha, most important. Free of karma, it's difficult of course for us because we are yet still dependent on karma. But at least we have the opportunity to cleanse our thoughts during practice during our application. So this is very important. And out of that, if we aspire with our collective effort, I am very sure, I am very certain that yet again, we will be graced by His physical manifestation again. And all the way, I shall try my best to support you in your practice, support you in your aspiration, and encourage you. Do we make this request, or do we aspire for the swift return? What is the absolute way, and so on? And for that, again, we have the fortunate circumstance to have great forces right now, meaning who have shown us the way how to aspire this will return, such as the aspiration for aspiration prayer for self return which is composed by my brother his um, eminence Rudin Kenjari Mache and so on who have composed such words and those words are composed out of devotion, out of respect, out of pure thought, out of bodhicitta, and put together in a manner that is known as perfect speech or ritual speech, where there is um, a no um, unclean or any kind of taintment, if that's the right word. So it's free of uh, such, let's say, um, not perfect speech. So out of that, if you pray, if you follow those prayers, with our, of course, kind, with our uh, devotion, with our, with respect, then Whatever we want to say, whatever we want to aspire, is channeled through those virtuous and perfect words. So, I hope that helps. So please, aspire, aspire in that way.